morning treasure finders. I just wanted to pop on here and let you know that I made it to Sanibel. So excited, this is my second stop. I'm at the lighthouse in Sanibel. I was up at Blind Pass earlier and I found so many great shells and I can't wait to show you what I found. So stay tuned. This is day one on Sanibel. Hopefully there'll be a lot more days to share with you. for a really long time. And this is the second one I found this morning on Captiva. And this one's broken too. I just found a broken one. But this is called a carrier shell. And I've been looking for these for years. And I found two already this morning. They're both broken, but
wanted to do a quick shell and tell of my finds today. I'm going to show you kind of the stuff down here at the bottom first, and then I'll move the camera up. I know it might be a little bit hard to see everything. And I'm going to use this little pointer because my hands shake. If you guys know that about me, my hands shake. So I'm going to use this little pointer today. We'll start over here. These are bubble shells and a whole bunch of fighting conks in all sizes. All of these are fighting conks. I won't pick up as many of these as time goes on because it's just exciting because this is the first day. So I picked up all kinds of them and I absolutely love the little juvenile ones. So right here are a couple little horse conks. We call those candy corn. And these are little drills. I did put some of these broken shells over here. This is a piece of a lion's paw and I've only found one lion's paw in my life. It was sort of a juvenile size. It was about that big. But this one would have been a huge one. These this is a broken shell, which is an adult version of one that I couldn't figure out in my last video, and I think it might be a king's crown. So if you know that what that is, let me know. I'll show you the picture of the tiny shell that I couldn't figure out. These two shells here, I've never found these before, and I can't believe I found two in one day. I've been looking them for them forever. They are a carrier snail. They're both broken, but I wanted to show you what they are. They actually attach other shells to themselves for camouflage and for other reasons. But I've, they're sort of semi-rare and I've never found any. So that was cool to find two of those. This is a, a little broken calico clam. I just wanted to show you what those look like. Okay, so moving on right over here. This is a ribbed cardita. These are spiny jewel box right here. This is a little swirly shell. I don't know what this is. If somebody knows, let me know. That'd be great. These are flat scallops, which I love to find. This is a sweet little baby's ear. Oh, I love these. See, they look like an ear. Love to find those. Here are some banded tulips. These are all olives here. Some are, some are in really good shape. Some aren't as in good of shape. Right here are some Florida cones. Also love to find those. These right here are painted cockles and a bunch of worm snails. These are all lightning whelks right here. These are cockle shells. These are smaller ones. This is obviously a giant cockle. Super cool. There's a little piece of sea glass. These are augers right here. So all of these scallops, I just love the colors of the scallops and look at that little sweet baby right there. These are slipper snails and they have a little area there where the animal lives. It's a kitten's paw. So here's a little turkey wing. Here's an apple murex. And here's several chestnut turbans. These are really cool. I'll find a lot of these when I get up to Clearwater, I'm pretty sure. These are serifs. Many different sizes. All of these here. And then there's one little jingle. I didn't pick up very many jingles today. I do like to collect these. They're super, almost paper thin, but they're pretty durable. I do like to find jingles. And lastly, right here, I forgot to mention are some shark eyes. I don't think I talked about these. There's three of those. And this, this is actually two shark eyes. This is um, more of a gaudy nautica. I don't know if you can see that or not. Same family, different name. So here is the whole haul from today. So to stay tuned. And I will take you back to Sanibel on another day. Thanks for watching.